Well, well, well. Look what we have here, guys. It's Tessa. Hi. You guys have been asking what happened to her, where she's been, and here she is. <laughs> it's been a long time. It's, it's been a really long time. But yeah, I mean, a lot of you guys have also, have actually been commenting saying, where's Tessa? Where's your girlfriend? And uh, the truth is, she works a normal Monday through Friday job, like most normal people. So she can never come out with me. But here she is, and we're going to be camping tonight. Because it's Friday. <laughs> this is actually going to be her first time spending the night in the camper. So that's pretty exciting. Are you stoked? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I hope it's uh, comfy. It looks really comfy. Let, let me show you guys the setup we got. It's a little bit different than the normal. Are you gonna come check it out? I, I, I saw it, but I'll check well, it out. Well, you have to do it for the video. You have to check uh, it out. Okay. Wow. Hey, pretty nice. As you guys can see, we have not just one bed here that I usually sleep on, but we have a spare guest bedroom down here. And the little storage box that I usually have in the back over there, took that out uh, so we can make room for my guest here. Well, actually, this is the guest bed. Oh, I'm this pretty, I'm your... pretty sure this one has been here. This is the guest bed. <laughs> if you want this... that one, that's actually, I, I think this one's probably gonna be more comfy, so. Mm, Whatever you want. This is the guest bed. I think it looks pretty cozy for for a very last minute makeshift setup here. I think it's gonna work. Yeah. It's gonna work. Oh, I forgot you had a fan. Oh yeah. Cool. All right. Night. Okay. Um. Well, I guess I'll just uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> it was very aggressive. It was. It kind of feels weird to uh, kind of feel feels weird to be filming with another person, especially especially you. I haven't filmed with you in so long. I know. What was the she last was like a co-star on my channel for a while. You November. guys remember that when I was working when we were working on the Slumber Queen? She was in all of my videos. Now it's been like it's been months. Yeah. I mean, when I had the Slumber Queen, I think it's not a coincidence that she was more willing <laughs> Why? to come camping when I had the Slumber Queen. Because oh. there's like a kitchen and like a little house. Anyways, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh, I forgot to shake it. Shake your beer? Yeah, you're supposed to, with blue moons, you're supposed to oh, like, slowly. Turn, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> shake it, like, shake weight. It's a big bag of snacks. Hell yeah. Busting out. You're gonna crack those right now? Yeah. <laughs> vegan chocolate chip cookies. I'm not vegan, but yeah, no, these are the best cookies ever. <laughs> you just eat the whole thing in one. I don't think these are snack size cookies. You guys are gonna think we're really extra for uh, what we brought, but when you have power on the go, you could afford to bring things like this. This is, this is gonna be the first time that I've done this, but I figured why not? Why not bring the rice cooker? Why not bring the rice cooker camping? A few people have commented hating that I have used Uncle Ben's in the past, so not today. Today we're using the real deal. There's a better cumin. A more aesthetic, aesthetic cumin. Why do you have two cumin in here? I don't know. Paprika? Paprika, yes. Black pepper. What's this, cayenne? Chili. Oh, do I have cayenne? Yeah, that's cayenne. First rule of cooking rice, always wash it. Okay? Got it? All right. Ow. 
no guys this the bag just fell off the table <laughs> <laughs> the pretzel bag ripped open. This wasn't e this was a brand new bag of peanut butter pretzels. And now look at it. Soiled. Soiled it. Soiled it. I'm just gonna wait there while it cooks. Mm-hmm. All right. This is my contribution. I don't like that's it. So I should probably tell you guys what we're making. Uh, tonight for dinner, we're making a potato and chickpea and cauliflower curry. Four teaspoons, so two teaspoons. One, two. One and a half teaspoons of paprika, so that means three quarters of a teaspoon. That just looked like <laughs> one teaspoon. <laughs> one tablespoon. That was not a tablespoon, no way. It might have been a whole teaspoon. All right, Rachel okay. Ray. I actually had kind of a crush on Rachel Ray when I was, when I was a kid. Half a teaspoon I don't blame cayenne. you. She, the woman knew how to cook. She did. 30 minute meals. Okay. All those spices are sticking. Oh, it smells so good. It smells good. And we're gonna deglaze the, the pot shortly here. Don't you worry. In go the potatoes. The problem with pre-cut vegetables, and I never get pre-cut vegetables, but today I was just being lazy because we're camping. They always make the chunks so big. Like, who the heck wants who wants a piece of cauliflower that big? It's like, I don't know. The Hulk could eat a cauliflower that big. And that's about it. No one else. Everyone's cooking burgers. We're out here cooking curry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there we go. the can. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, perfect. Yes. That's how you do rice while you're camping. So we started at 54% and then Jackery went down all the way to 39% to cook the rice. It actually ended up drawing a lot more electricity than I was expecting. I think it was what, like 400 watts, 450 watts it was drawing, which that's actually a lot. That's a lot more than I would have thought. I thought it was going to be like, I don't know, like 200, maybe 300 watts. Oh, well, whatever. We need to have a chat. You guys might be wondering where the heck I've been. I didn't post a video last week, and a couple weeks ago, I also didn't post a video. It's just been a very busy last month. My truck broke down, and I was dealing with mechanical issues for a while. It took a while to get the part, so it was I was in, I was unable to go film while my truck was out of commission, obviously. And then just recently, I was on a 10 day backpacking trip. It was in Washington, it's called the Wonderland Trail. Some of you might know what that is. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you already are aware that I was on the trail. Uh, if you're not following me, feel free to follow me at Jonathan Yench. It was a beautiful, amazing experience. It was 100 miles. It was a great trip overall. I didn't really, I got some footage on my phone, but I didn't bring my big camera, so I'm not gonna have a formal video on that trail, unfortunately. I thought that it would just, it would just be a long time to carry my camera around and film. Uh, 10 days, just a lot of filming, and I don't wanna have to worry about all the batteries and all that. I'm back now, I'm excited to continue on the videos, 
and hopefully now that Tessa is showing her face in this one hopefully she's gonna make some appearances more often but I've missed you guys and that's all I got it's so weird having this camping experience because for the past like 10 days I was on a backpacking trip literally living in dirt in like the remote backcountry for 10 days this is as crowded camping as it gets that's all right it's kind of like a glamping experience compared to being on trail chug 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 <laughs> that's kind of fratty <laughs> We have spoons. It's fine. Don't tell me how to live. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh man. Wow. Okay guys, this is uh, Camp Curry. It smells great. Looks great. See how it tastes. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. That bite was really like synchronized. I have like PTSD right now from all the mosquito bites that I got on trail. Now anytime I feel like the slightest little bug on me, I'm like, Mosquito! This video probably feels way different to you guys than my other videos, so I hope you're still in enjoying it. Seems like it's a bit more lively. That's good. You're welcome. Because I actually have somebody to like banter with, whereas when, when I'm just by myself, it's like a little more, a little more chill, you know? We get the mm. chill vibes usually. I bring the party. Look at this. I barely touch my food and I'm already full. It's gotten into me. You want it? Yeah, just pile it up. Just have two. Alright, fine. Just <laughs> save it for later. Honestly, I have to, I really have to be in the mood for curry to want it. And when I was planning the food for this trip, curry sounded good. But when it came down to it, I wasn't really in the curry mood. So I think that also makes me not that hungry for curry. Teamwork makes the dream work. Is that what the, they say? Yes. Oh yeah, we got a torch, guys. I got this for times like this when I'm being lazy and I don't have to prove to myself nor to Tessa that I could start a fire from scratch. I just, I wanna, I just wanna get it started. And the torch has been really nice. It's like a great cheat code. On. Here I am saying, I could start a fire from scratch and I can't even light a match. Oh, 
<sighs> it's kind of warm, but I think it's going to cool off. Keep that open fully. This is fun. It's kind of like a sleepover. Where? Do you not see them? Those are mosquitoes. They're not? <laughs> I miss. No, those are just little mats. Oh. This is my first time having a guest in this camper. It's nice. I like it. Do you? Mm -hmm. it's simple, right? Compared to the slumber queen. Yeah, it's simple, but sometimes, like, this is needed. Yeah, I think this is, uh, this comfortable. There's a freaking fan. This is luxury. Yeah, this is nice. I like this. Oh, it's so warm. It's too warm. All the blankets touching my skin are causing sweat. Then, don't use them. It's not, I'm not using them, I'm literally laying on top of them. It's Never causing sweat. Yeah. Alright guys, well, we gotta wake up very early for paddle boarding, so... See you in the morning. First night in the camper. Yeah. Sleep tight. Don't let the mosquitoes bite. Don't let the mosquitoes bite. Good night. Good night. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. Good morning. Good morning. How'd you sleep in there? Pretty good. I'm so tired though. I can tell. Oh, the other one takes like five minutes. This one takes like a minute or less. Oh. Cookies for breakfast? Camp Cookie Dish. <clears throat> Woo! So Tessa was just putting no. her hands in her the back of her shorts and she was like, oh, I have back pockets? Since when? And she just was like so genuinely excited and happy. And then two minutes, <laughs> two seconds later, she's like, oh, my shorts are off. Backwards. Yeah. <clears throat> Oh yeah. Wow, Jinx. Jinx, you owe me a soda. You don't like soda. Jinx, you owe me a beer. We have beer. gonna be the cheerleader. Go Tessa, go. Go Tessa.
right, y'all, we have made it onto the water and obviously we're on one paddleboard. Tessa and I are both sharing this one. And the reason is because we only have one paddleboard. And if I'm being completely honest, this is actually Tessa's paddleboard. So the other video where I rode it out onto the lake, uh, Tessa let me borrow it. So thank you for that. Of course, it'd be a little bit more ideal to have two paddle boards, but realistically two people can fit on one and it's totally fine. And uh, it's actually kind of nice having my own personal paddler so I could just sit here and relax. So it's thank you for that, Tessa. Out. Oh, I can't. It's actually dangerous. It's a safety hazard for the back person to be paddling. I've never seen that. What? Never seen the water. Oh. We're watching the water. It's going to make you cry. Is it really a good yeah. movie? It's really fantastic. Really? Oh. Oh. Okay. Hopefully, I don't fall off. Come on, dude, you're going on YouTube. Do a gainer. Oh, he did a gainer. Oh, he heard me. He listened. Okay. Oh, sorry. Ah. We came from way over there somewhere. All right, thanks for the ride. See you later. Wow. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? What the heck? They always come back. You felt bad? Yeah. Well, thanks for coming back for me. Yeah, no problem. You got I would have just swam back. All right, all right. It's my turn now. See them. I think you're supposed to let go. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think they know how it works. I've seen some big fish jump out of the water here. I'm gonna have to come back here and fish. It's also super, it looks super pressured though. There's all kinds of people out here fishing. Ow. Oh my God. Johnny, get even. Make Johnny. Sure my <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Johnny, you're not even on right. Look at you. Johnny, <laughs> sit down or get right. Edge. Oh, Jesus. Ugh. Give me a heart attack. Viking right now.
All right, we made it. Land ho. <laughs> And that is gonna do it for this video. I know it probably felt a little bit different than my usual videos, and that's because I got back from the 10 day backpacking trip earlier this week, so I didn't really have too much time to film. Things were a little bit rushed, but the videos will continue as per usual next week. Hopefully, hopefully Tessa decides to show face in the videos more often now that we got her in here uh, for the first time in a while. Uh, what do you think? Was it, was it doable? Was yeah. it fun? Yeah, it was fun. I missed it. Oh, for sure. Be in some future vids. All right. Make sure to leave comments down below, encouraging Tessa <laughs> to show up in my videos more often. All right, guys, that's going to do it. Thank you guys like us for watching. You guys go out there and go on some adventures of your own. Live life. Beat the status quo. Y'all know the drill. Enjoy the rest of your day, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace. I would advise against this if you're prone to seasickness.